All right, welcome back to another iconic Masters draft on Magic Online. I got Mike B back here. And uh, what do we take? Do we take this Genesis Hydra? Seems fun. It does seem good, um, especially because you get so much ramp in this format, and it's nice to actually have something to ramp into. Yeah, that seems pretty sweet. Yeah, I'm going to take this, this Genesis Hydra. Tormentor's good. Um... It's also uncommon, and it dies to a lot of things, like Draconic Roar, Ulcerate, Rift Bolt. I mean, there's a ton of answers to, to the 5-3. To the Why does this song stuck in my head? That's okay, you'll just say something in five minutes and get me... Get my head stuck in something else. Oh, we could have had the double tormentor draw. And by draw, I mean draft. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Totally. Totes. Totes, my goats. What do we take here, though? Shaman? I do like Shaman because it's a nice way to uh, draw one single card in a green deck. We could take Tormentor and be green black. Could do that. I don't know how good that is, though. I think it's probably just better to go with Shaman. I like Shaman. Fog Bank is a good blue card. And I don't hate blue green. Hmm. Not really much in this pack. Except for Killing Fiend, the other card. I think Fog Bank is probably better, though. What did you say before Fog Bank? Killing Fiend. Um, I don't think this is going to be a Killing Fiend deck, though. I don't think green... Or... Well, not yet. Well, I don't think green red is the Killing Fiend deck, though. But your red provides plenty of things to trigger it. I'm going to take the Fog Bank. How about that? I won't stop you. <laughs> Good. A Boiler works. Oh, Hunt the Week. I think Hunt the Week's probably better than the off-color... Uh... Yeah. That's a removal spell. I think red blue is also Kiln Fiend. <laughs> Psycho Tiger Man, I was like, not going to really hoping for the legendary giant. I don't think that makes any sense. I like an amass. Mm, there's also a repeal, but I think amass is better than a repeal. Yeah, you down? I'm down to clown. I just like getting confirmation from you, man. I don't want I don't want to do anything without your without your say so, without your go ahead. Flies. Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I like carrot carve and carry at it. It blocks everything and you draw a card. I think we can get more phantom monsters, but this being uncommon is pretty sweet. Mm, try it out. We can just play the wall look, we can still be the wall deck. Oh, perfect. Absolutely perfect. It's pretty good. That's exactly what we want. Hopefully we'll get a Mind Stone, but there's like so many of them. <laughs> there's Mind Stone. I say this every single time. There's Guardian Idol, Mind Stone, Star Compass, and Mannequin. So the odds of us getting at least one of them is pretty high. Hunt or Mass? I think it's Hunt again. Yeah, it's Hunt. Yeah, that's pretty easy. I mean, it's not that easy. Like, a Mass is great. Tannen, what was what's one of your favorite blue cards in this format? A mass or um, repeal? I like worm here. Probably old big dummy. Old big dummy. What up, Mavaka Ghost? Oh, Frostlinks is fine. I think I underestimate lure, but I also don't think I over. I don't think I underestimate it that much. It's not that great. Ah, oh, Thought Scour. Got it. Your favorite blue cards in the in this format? Oh, one of your favorite blue cards ever is in this format. I thought you said it's one of your favorite blue cards in this format, and I was like, that's weird. Yeah, it's very good all time. I mean, it does a lot of things. Like, it turns on Delve. It uh, It's easy to Snapcast it back and draw another card. It also mills your opponent, which is nice, because that's a, a legitimate strategy in Modern. 
Gataxi and Grave Troll. Wow, your name is so many modern cards that are banned. What is this key in the front of your name? What is that? How do you get that? I don't know what that is. What is that? What is it? No idea. I don't know what that is. Any key.org pledge? What does that mean? Oh yeah, we've done we drafted a ton of black. We did lose two indulgent tormentors. What does that mean? What are you guys saying right now? Oh, so far we haven't how are we doing? So far we haven't lost the game, but we did lose two indulgent tormentors. I wouldn't say we lost them. <laughs> Oh, River Wheel Aerialist is good. Dees. Dees. No. You know how it goes. Oh, I actually like Aerial Predation a lot in this format. Yeah, because of those stupid dragons. There's a ton of flyers. Eh, Praise of Vengeance is whatever. Wow. Spider it is. Wow. Every card we have is playable, wow. I think. Wow. Good old night. I think it's just overgrown battlement here. Probably. This is actually great, and uh, we do have multiple walls to go with it. Could be Mana Lake, but I think overgrown battlement does. Well, I mean, like, we're trying to get to Genesis Hydra and Duskdale Worm, so. What was a rare in that pack? I didn't even care. It wasn't for us. It was neither of the Oh, that's right. We did say that. <gasps> oh, that's a good one. Oh, girl. That is a that is a jolly good fellow. Oh yeah, we got Genesis Hydra, Rampaging Bailoff. Yes, please. Easy pick. Oh, another carbon carry added. Oh, I think it's this guy though. Yeah, guys, pretty decent. Wow, someone passed this to us. That's great. That gives me a good feeling about the green. Yeah, I'm gonna take Mahamodi. Mahamodi. Mahamodi or your Hamodi? It's Ma it's Mahamodi, bro. Okay. You don't know. You don't know me. <sighs> Called shot on the pack three Genesis wave. Got back just in time for the good stuff. Nice. We got a rampaging Bayloth here. That's pretty sweet. Which was passed to us. And I think one of the big problems with the blue-green deck is you don't have a lot of removal, but we have double Hunt the Week, which is nice. And also, Hunt the Week on this still deals 3 damage, and then you get 3-6. Hey, that's pretty good. Me, 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 me. I don't know. I don't know why you're like this. Star Compass, Repeal, Dissolve. I almost like Star Compass better than these other two. Like good repeal, but ramp is pretty pretty key in this deck. Right, and I don't think we want double blue on turn three. Like we're clearly very very heavy black or very heavy green here. I think it's actually compass, and it feels weird because I think compass is the weakest card, but I also think it's the best card for us. There's that Roshin meander. How much is bobble still? If bobble's like four tickets, I might just take it. I'll be honest with you guys. I hate to do it, but. Eh, it's only three. I think it's fine to pass. I think Meander is just so much better for us, especially with Genesis Hydra. Oh, yeah. Although, I don't mind a second of mass. I don't mind any of these cards. If if this, 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 or this came back... I'll, God, even though Steer Command is in here, that's insane. Yeah, we'll take this guy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Archangel of Thune is hard to splash because it's double white. It's not really a splashy card. I think it's just Moonglove Extract. I like having a Moonglove Extract. It kills a lot of relevant things. Now, Fireball we probably splash because that's easy. I'm going to take the Moonglove. The only other card is either Timberland or Praise Vengeance, and I don't think we're playing either of those. We could take the... That's good. It's always weird to me that this is uncommon. This card is very good. 
I'm going to take it. I owe Moonglow Extract a lot of money. Well, you better, you better, uh, you better get paying or else they put the juice on it. And then you got to... The vig. The vig. Get the, what's the, what's the vig? How many points? I'll take wild size here, I guess. You could play that. Yeah, I don't hate it. It does say draw a card on it. My first iconic draft, I splashed divisions. I picked up in pack three in my white green life gain deck. Nice. Sounds like it was a Bant life gain deck to me. <laughs> so we got Plant Hydra, Regular Hydra, Beast, Dijin, Dijin Monk. I'm just taking Sandstone Oracle. It's a big dumb nerd. Maybe we play it, maybe we don't, whatever. As far as ramp goes, we just have these two right now. I would love to have like a Thran Dynamo or another Overrun Battle would be great. Which Avacyn? Archangel Avacyn? Yes. Eight mana Avacyn? It's rough. I'm going to take all the Aerial Predations because I think the only decks we lose to are the Flying decks. I'll take both of those actually. Probably play Jotty. I, yeah, I don't actually hate that. Especially because, again, it goes with our wall theme. Yeah, 8 mana Avacyn's pretty tough. Because 8 mana is significantly more than 7 mana. There's actually a... It's funny, there's like a formula where like drawing your 8th mana is actually much harder to do than drawing your ninth, your 7th your mana. You don't play that guy? Grove of the Burn Willows. Might just be Grove Couple here. Tickets. I think it's like it's like six. I definitely have to take the Grove because it just pays for at least a third of the draft. And also, if we happen to get a Fireball, it's very splashable. I won't cross my fingers, but I also think our deck is pretty good shape here, and I'm pretty sure we can get another Amass if we really want one, even. But you enlarge my wheel too. You know, when you're playing the um, search. Yeah, definitely search. If you're playing the the non-phantom drafts that like you can't really ignore a five to six ticket card. Search is cool here. Boom. Got it. Plus this gives our opponent life, which is just kind of a nice thing to do. Is this good in the green deck? Probably. It turns all our all our walls, all our dumb walls into five five dragons. Yeah, why not? That's pretty cool. Hunt the weak, repeal, and a dissolve. There's an abyssal persecutor. I think we want a repeal. Or maybe just another hunt the weak. I don't know. I think it's definitely one of these, yeah. I'm going to put you in the sideboard, though. I don't want that many seven drops. Repeal is also good with Roshin Meander. Oh, yeah. That's kind of cool. I'll put you in the X spot. Yep, Car Maverick knows what's up. There's an enlar Oh, another Roshi Meander. I think that's actually perfect. Just a solid stats. Yeah, it's just a 4 4 4 4. I think it's probably better than a. We have a bunch of three drops, too, so I don't feel terrible about taking another four drop. And if you can go turn three Roshin Rander into turn four, like Hydra for six, it's actually very good. Which would be eight mana. So you'd have four from this. And then, uh, well, actually you'd have five mana that turn because you had four mana on turn three, five mana on turn four with Roshin. So it's nine. So you can actually do it for seven, which is the, like the perfect amount for us. Claustrophobia. Yeah, definitely claustrophobia. I do like this a lot though, because Genesis Hydra would get trample. Um, Heroes Bane would get trample. The creatures we wild size would get trample. But this is pretty solid removal, so we're just gonna take the claustrophobia. And another mass. Our, oh, Wall of Roots. I think it's actually Wall of Roots here. Yeah, it's really good. We don't have a ton of two drops, and it's great with uh, Overgrown Battlement. 
This is also 28 cards. We need to start making some cuts. Greater Basilisk can go on the sideboard. Another search for... Oh, Jungle Barrier? Mm, how many walls are we going to play? I would just take the search. God, 2-6 blocks everything. And we draw a card? I think search lets us play less land. I mean, search seems better, 100%. Wow. This is our pack one search, I think. Hmm. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. This is our pack one. No one is playing green, apparently. Could play in a large. I'm just going to keep, keep taking search. I don't think it's... I don't think a large... Um... Could be in the next pack, too. It was another pack, so we might get one anyway. No, this is this is our first pack. No, I mean it was in a pack after that. We took that one. Oh, we did. Okay. Yeah. We want a third search or we want this enlarge? I think we want enlarge. I think it's just a more versatile card. I'm going to take the serum powder, whatever. I will take all. I'm not going to play a second river wheel. I'm, I might play three aerial predations against the right deck. What? Okay. Wow. Hmm. All right. Well, that's the thing, I guess. Eh, whatever. Wow, oh, nice. it did come back. Holy smokes. Green was so open in this draft. That's unbelievable to me. So we're definitely playing 15 lands with double search and a Simic, uh, Simic Growth Chamber. Which means we have three cuts to make. Hmm. I think we can cut Carvin Carry Added. Oh, actually, we can cut Jotty Offshoot. Yeah. It's kind of underwhelming. Two more cuts, huh? No, I don't think there's any incentive to go mono green. We have way too much fixing. There's just no incentive to do so. Like, we get really good removal, like Claustrophobia. We get Amassed Components card draw. We get Flyers. Day of the Dragon is huge. Repeal is good. It's the toilet. The plumbing is weird. Okay. I was like, that doesn't sound normal. Yeah, it's not. I think we can actually cut one Hunt a Week. Hunt a Week's a card you don't really want to draw a million of. I guess. Because sometimes you just don't have a creature. That's good. It's a bad top deck when you're behind. So this is 14 lands. So still need one more cut. Sounds hilarious in there. I think we just cut the enlarge for now. Yeah, I guess. Why, you don't like that? We can actually cut Duskdale Worm. I don't think we're in any shortage of having big dudes. Yeah, I think that's better than... I think enlarge is a good trick to have. All right. So, 8-5. Eight, 8-5. Five. <laughs> Toilet's making really weird noises That'd right now. 9-6. I think we can do 8-7. Oh, you mean like... With the other land, yeah. I, my only reluctance is because you definitely want to hit green for turn one. Yeah. And once you hit green, like, these are also blue sources. So I think this is actually fine. All right. Yeah. Oh, oh, look at that. That's that's good. You're sneaking in a red there. Okay. Oh, that makes it much better. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, now it's eight, seven. All right. Also, tell that mountain to get out of there. All right, we did it. All right, sweet. I think this deck looks great. <laughs> you want me to go check that? The toilet's like bubbling. It does it all the time when like the because uh, it's connected to the same line as the the washing machine. The funny thing is, there's no nothing else running right now, so I don't know why it's doing that. There's probably a rat in there. Oh god! Just trying to get out. Yeah, also, if you guys haven't done so, please feel free to follow or subscribe. Both those things help me out. And if you guys are watching this on YouTube, feel free to hit those like and subscribe buttons. Both of those things uh, are a great way to support the channel. And if you're watching me on Twitch, go to my YouTube page and, and, and subscribe to me there. Do all the things. I will play first. Mm, yeah, I'll keep this in. 
One day. It's a pack rat copying himself. <laughs> you know what? Maybe it is. Maybe it is. Fifteen lands. We're gonna draw a million lands. You ready? The problem with fifteen lands is that you still have Star Compass, Wall of Roots, Search, Search, Overgrown Battlement in your deck. So you basically have twenty mana sources. Hmm. And I wonder, um, definitely not blocking you. I wonder if we have more than 20. Oh, they missed a land drop? That's pretty cool. I think Day of the Dragons is even great here because even if we just make two, two, five, fives, like, that's still pretty good. This is where they go land, pillar, equip. Ready? Waiting. Got the land. One down. Electrolyze instead. Okay, sure. That's actually better for you, but whatever. <laughs> oh, boy. Might as well just actually cast it. Well, yeah, I'm not going to suspend it. Are you crazy? Just a little bit. So now we can cast Day of the Dragons for one dude. Can we draw a Rampaging Baloth? That would be sweet. Yeah, we'll Genesis Hydra. One, two, three, four, six, seven. For eight. Six, six Genesis Hydra. That would be pretty good. The problem with Genesis Hydra is that if we do Day of the Dragons, it's gonna it comes back into play and it gets no counter, so it dies immediately. That is a concern. To be fair, this game, we've drawn one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine cards that produce mana, and then a fog bank, a day of the dragons, and a, and a rhino that do not. So nine to three is our ratio as far as cards that, that give us mana and cards that don't. And one of those is pretty bad. So we're basically uh, battling with two actual cards. Our opponent has seven cards in hand. Seems like we're, I think we got this game under control. And we're running the race. Hmm. That's old Roshi. Why don't you... Why? I got four mana in there. Just use the four mana. Alright. Let's see what happens. That makes our Day of Dragons better. It's actually just lethal to turn out to recast it. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. So you have Pillar of Flame in hand, I assume? Or you just have Coordinated Strike? Interesting. So if you have Coordinated Strike, three... Oh, actually, it can't be Pillar now. We do have Lethal on the Crackback currently. Can we just take it and win? No, they gotta have something, though. Hold on, let me look it up and see what they have. Seems weird, but well, they're attacking for what three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I'm gonna look at Iconic Masters, wherever that is. Is it on here? Oh, I don't think it's on here. Do I have to just go Scryfall, whatever it's called. All right, give me one second, guys. Advanced search. I just don't know all the cards in this format, so we're gonna go to sets. Iconic Masters, red cards, mana cost, uh, converted mana cost equal to one, and instance. You can probably just search red one drops, it's fine. You're probably right. All right. Pillar hits players, but it also is a sorcery. So the only thing they can have is coordinated assault. Which would deal three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 
Yeah, I'm just gonna let it, I'm just gonna let him go through. Yep. I mean, if they had pillar, they they can't they can't do anything. Yep, they just lose. All right, cool. <laughs> Figured it out. Yeah, they were probably just hoping that we didn't block so they can get a free card because they're dead on the crackback. They might just not have anything. Um, but, yeah. So they're like the aggressive deck. I think we're bringing Jotty Offshoot. Take out the Crown Ceratok, maybe? Sure. Maybe bring a Moon Glove Extract to take out Day of the Dragons. I think that's actually pretty good. I think that's fine. Uh, Coordinated would have had three to the damage count because they also had Prowess on the other guy. So it would have been five and four. But it's still not lethal. Like, it would have went from 6 to 9. Which is interesting. But, yeah, we won. Oh, we won! I'm going to keep this hand, and I'm hoping we draw a 1 or a 2 mana spell in the first two turns so that our Simic Growth Chamber isn't awkward. Thank you! Got there. Wow, that was great. And we got a second blue for our Claustrophobia. Whew! The joy of... Uh, also, this is a third turn suspended Nantuko Shaman, which is pretty sweet. Of course, we'll be taking six damage by that turn, by that time. Yeah, what are you going to do? I mean, if they had both, like they'd have, they, have, they missed multiple land drops, so they would have had to, they would have had to draw exactly Mountain, and also have Pillar and Assault in hand. Like, that's ambitious. I'd rather not play around that random, like, 3% chance and then just, uh... Hmm. And then just win on the crackback. I like being able to untap and, uh... Hunt the weak. Maybe. 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 Like, especially considering they were missing land drops. Like, if they were not missing land drops, that's one thing, but that means they had to literally draw the mountain. Okay, that's actually fine. Oh, Unleashed, no less. That's interesting. So, if you do have Coordinated Strike... Okay, that's actually fine. That's a good one. That's a beautiful baby boy. Oh, I like Wall of Roots into Hunt the Week. Yeah. Which one are we killing, though? One is a 3-2 on attacks. This guy's probably better. Yeah. But this attacks for more next turn, is that relevant? Mm, kind of. I don't think so, because we have Claustrophobia. We'll just Claustrophobia it next turn. One, two, three, four. Uh, or we play Bayloth. The thing is, this guy can't get through a Bayloth. This guy can. So I think we actually kill this guy. All right. It does mean we can't attack this turn for four, though. This is true. It's not relevant. I don't know if we really care about that. It's a Four is a good amount. So one, two, three, four, five. That also means they're equipping next turn. I'm just gonna kill this guy because I think it's probably better than. I think the four damage is relevant here. Plus, if they don't equip, we can still block with Wall of Roots this turn. I don't want to play this until we can also play a land afterward, and we have two six drops to fill in that gap. Just think. All right, that's good. That's your turn. And now we can actually Claustrophobia if we wanted to. Oh, it, we can do it next turn, actually. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Never mind. We're just playing Bailoth next turn. 
Yeah, that's insane. Especially when they tapped out. Don't play land first yet. One, two, three, four. Always yes. Never going to say no to that. You can suspend the Baylock. Yeah, that's probably not we're just, we're going to play it before that ever comes down. I'm worried about them moving over this guy and then also having, like, Electrolyze. Like, if they have, like, Electrolyze and then... I guess they have to have another land. If they have, like, Pillar... Move over, then it's like one, two, three, four, five, six. We go to three. Okay, that's not a thing I care about. Yeah, all right. Claustrophobe being the guy that's unblockable is probably where we want to be right now. Yeah. Hmm. So we have one, two, three, four, six, seven mana. Three, four, five, six, seven. We can just play all of these things. As long as it involves Phosphor being the unblockable guy. Yeah, which I think is good. Like, I actually don't want to give them a dragon until we're able to play River, River Wheel Aerialists because I'd rather have a way to block their guy. Yes. Yeah, so, oh, God, it's so much damage that really be on the table, though. I guess they block here and they block here. They take six, but then we take one, two, three, four on the crackback. Plus the equip, five, six. Yeah, the equip is the scary part. Yeah, I'm not dealing with that. Because then if they have land pillar, then we're just... But it's also turn 8 and they've missed... Or turn 7 and they missed 3 land drops. So. Hoarding dragon? This is a quick tap. Oh, boy. That's a good one. I feel like we were in good shape up until that moment. Because now they can just make infinite blockers that make them 2 2 flyers, which is pretty bad. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Exactly. Remember that? Remember that old chestnut? Give me something good. All right, well, infinite five, 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 six flyers is pretty good. Three, four, five. I think we just attack with this guy with the trample. Oh, make an egg. I mean, the egg's going to die anyway, but just make sure we can get in for some damage, I guess. Kajiki jiki. That's a that's a that's a new meme, but it checks out. Yeah, whatever that means. Whatever you mean, nerd. Yep. God, the the Kiki Jiki Dragon Egg combo is so weak, but it's also so good in this matchup, like or in in this format rather. Like, all right, make a two two flyer every turn that I get to keep forever and get a free block out of it. He's blocking with the original. That's interesting. Now I can't make infinite. Oh, I like that actually. That's great. Seems weird. Okay. Huh. Just gave up his combo. Well, I think they're tr they're, they're banking on us not having uh, a flyer because then it's then they make a copy of the dragon and it's a two 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 that's six seven eight nine, and then we're just dead on board. You know what I mean? Okay. But we have Mahamodi Dijin. One two three four five six. So we have four blockers. Let's see if that's good enough. 
blue, white, and red spells are at their disposal. Yep, figured you'd move that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven if we block the flyer. But they'll probably double pump. So we actually take five. But if you do that, then you're tapping this, 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 and this. And then you have one blocker and you're probably dead on the crackback. Because you block here, you take 10. So your options with pumping and, and activating Kikijuki are not great. If you know what I'm saying. No, can you please explain it? Also, they haven't played any spells yet. Or they haven't played any... Yeah, spells is what I'm looking for. Just that guy, huh? Well, I will block. Because if you're spending two to pump, that's your turn, so... Deal. I like it. At the end of the turn, though, they can make a dragon and then make another dragon, which is still three dragons. So we're still, like, at the mercy of River Wheel Aerialist. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I like that we can play both of these, though. That's pretty sweet. Yeah, that's... And we can hit a land, which is pretty good. Which means we play another... Oh, we should have done it first, though, because now they could just kill this guy. Ah. I think if they do that, though, they're in bad shape, because that's going to take up a considerable amount of resources. Oh, coordinated strike in hand. That's pretty good. Here we go. Maybe not? Coordinated doesn't kill here or here. Maybe they're just chump blocking. Oh. Interesting. Never mind. I spoke too soon. One, two... Yep, that's pretty good. And they don't get the double uh double dragons as it were. I think we're I think we're winning this game. I think we got it. It feels like we might got it. Also, if you guys haven't done so, do me a solid and hit that like or subscribe button. Both of those things help me out. And you get all subscribers get access to the uh the subscriber Discord channel. Which you should hang out in. Cause Don't hate. Sweet. Subscriptiate. <laughs> I was like, who is that? And then I remembered who that was. All right. Got him. I don't remember who that is. Oh, we haven't watched The Room yet. Well, Mike, Mike has already seen it. I haven't seen it. Um, but we did watch two more Disaster Artist trailers tonight, which are just phenomenal. And I also um, downloaded the uh, The Room. Legally, 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 obviously, I've legally downloaded it from a legal website that legally legals. offers movies. That legals, it legals. It's a legal. It's my movie, and I want it now. Yes, I, I could join the Discord. I do have Discord. Yeah, and I also am subscribed. Are you? Yes. Yeah. I've been a subscriber for months, boy. God, you're a good friend. Yeah, every once in a while, I get an email. It's like, here's your receipt. And I'm like, for what? I'm like, oh yeah, because of that guy. It's. Yeah, it's only because Courtney finally joined. That was the reason. Before that, it was super boring. Um. Yes. This hand is this hand is good. That's a good hand. Give me a hand. It's too late. I already have one. Turn two star compass would actually be fine with me, or a simic growth chamber. You're tearing me apart, Lisa. <laughs> I don't even know if I've seen it, but I know how it sounds because of the... Oh, man. That's good stuff, man. That is a movie right there, dude. It's full of memes. 
I find it slightly weird that people get the disaster artist if they haven't seen the room, but I guess that's the power. That's exactly it. Like it's a cult movie. So like I knew about it long before I had even seen it. So when I saw the disaster artist, I was like, oh, that's interesting. Woo, spooky. Did you know that Rampaging Ballast is secretly a seven drop? I, I, I did know that, yes. <laughs> oh, man. It's like, just never play this guy on turn six. No, you never want to do that. You're in bad times if you do that. Ooh, also, interesting. Uh, what? Ooh, spicy. Got to get it in there, man. Oh, that's good. Man, what if we draw land and we could save the search? That's greedy. No, because you search now, and if you draw a land, then you play this yeah, and play yeah. the land. I meant, I meant to like be greedy and try to draw a land naturally. Right, but then we still wouldn't be able to play this next turn because the natural land we'd have to play for our sixth oh, land. Oh, sure. So we'd have to wait a turn after we did that. All right, so this guy can just block you forever now, even though you use this hammer hand, right? Yep. It's all right. He's got electrolyzed for it. Fighting is not considered combat damage, so if we fought, our guy would die. I mean, we can still fight the Halberdier, but it they would, would die. Lose the fight. Well, they'd both lose, technically. Land. There are no winners here. Well, we have a six drop, and fight the weak. Hunt the weak is very good on this six drop. Fight the weak. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you're doing, right? Like, you're fighting the weak. Let's be real. This is where they tap Roshin Meander to fireball both of our guys. Four, five, six, seven, eight. So they'll have a fireball for seven. They'll deal five and, well, they'd have to have one more land. So they go land, fireball, both of our guys, and attack for... think we'll ever get to have a fireball when we have that card? I think that'll ever happen. Roshi Mander? Yeah. I don't think so. Sounds sounds greedy to me. This is probably draft five out of five. Where we dra wow! Aggro. Wow, wow, Like the things you have to do to, to kill this guy, that's a lot. Plus, I want to draw a card so I can rampage all over your face. Oh, nothing happened. That's not what we're looking for. You gonna kill this guy? You have five cards. And this is a two for one, as far as I'm concerned. Three for one? Sure. So you can see why you don't want more more hunt the weeks because there's definitely situations where you're just like this card is a blank. Oh, I was gonna fight that, but then I'm like it's only a one three. It does still doesn't kill it. Land. <gasps> that That's like the best tokens. land ever, dude. It makes infinite tokens. Always yes, always yield. <laughs> yeah, boy. That's, uh... Yeah, get in there, Fogbank. That's pretty good. <sighs> oh, 4-4? Four, four? Oh, that's dead. That's great. Thanks for playing. Ooh, that's pretty spicy. But we should wait, because we can make even more. You seem pretty weak, Scion. Man, this is a combo right here, bro. I would have bounced a regular land there. What? Why? So we could play Form of the Dragons and kill them. Uh, we only have five guys. I'll just wait till we have enough guys to do that. Touche. It's pronounced Tucci. It's not. Actually, it's it's one thousand percent Tucci. Look it up in the English dictionary. It's Tucci. <laughs> Every card they play is just... It's honestly just worse than our cards, I'll be honest. And our card is literally Simic Growth Chamber. Us playing and bouncing Simic Growth Chamber is stronger than everything they're playing right now. Mm, regular land. That's pretty good because it lets us... Uh, play it. Yeah. <laughs> I hate you so much. Oh, now we can. Oh, it already has trample. Derp. I was gonna say. Oh, now we have our one guy have trample, but he. he we can put did. a counter on a different one and give that one trample. Ooh, that's good. 
I am a little afraid of them having... I guess it doesn't matter. They only got one card, man. Just go for it. Oh, they do only have one card, don't they? Plus, I mean, at worst, we're just trading with it, right? It's fine. Yeah, and it's only a token. Oh, we didn't... They didn't... They, they died. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Never attack with the original man. There's, yeah, there's no reason to do it. I will attack with one yeah. of these guys, though. Now I want five guys. What happened? Did I say five guys? I wait till we have five guys. Is that what I said? <laughs> wait till we have those delicious French fries. Yeah, I can't believe I didn't get the Cajun. I just got to redo my whole week, man. Yeah, Mike and I actually went to five guys. Like, what was it last night? Uh, yeah. And I got Cajun fries and he didn't. And he just like, I, I always forget though, every time. I feel like we should just only do Cajun fries. Is this the time where we just, we just attack there's, with there's all these the guys? Time. Yeah, see what happens. And then we'll day after that to make a million guys. How many days? One day. That's all right. That's a Matis Yahoo song. Oh, they just conceded. They're like, once you attack, I'm out, bro. I think this is another match where Jotty Offshoot's fine. They have a bunch of 2-2s. Two yeah. Their 2-2s two do become 3-3s. Three They're like, one's a 3-2, three one's a 3-3. Three three. So that's unfortunate. Moon Glove Extract, also very good. Maybe Carry Added's better. Carry Added's probably better than Jotty Offshoot, then. And I'm going to take the day out, because I don't think we super need it. I think day is more fun than anything. You okay, man? No. It's not even... It's like just barely 10 o'clock, bro. I'm gonna go to sleep. Never Cajun fries? You said that. Courtney wow, said that. that's crazy. That's weird. Why would you say that, though? No. Oh, I actually love eating... I love Five Guys is great. I don't even eat meat. I just get a veggie sandwich with fries because it's delicious. And I get extra pickles on it. And I get it all the way, no mushrooms. Now you guys know my Five Guys order. So if you guys... If we ever go to Five Guys, you can, you'll know exactly what I'm gonna get. You can order for you. Yeah, they can push me out of the way and be like, I got this. Did I just hit you in the face? You did. You did hit me in the face. <laughs> that was classic. Yeah. That's like an old-timey Acme cartoon. Oh, this hand would be so good if this is a search instead. Doesn't seem good. It does, though, doesn't it? God, you are so greedy. That is better. It's like, yeah. That's like, yeah. It's, it's like, yeah. Halberdier? No. All right, that's Veggie good. Veggie sandwiches are also annoying to make. Really? That's sad. Why are they, what's annoying to make about them? Big Daddy Bailoth. BDB, if you will. You need those three Stooges sound effects for when you accidentally hit Mike in the head. Yeah, that's true. Um, oh. Wing. I'm just going to cast this bad boy. One, two, three, four. If we hit a land next turn, we can... I guess I'll just repeal this guy. That's pretty good. We are going to take one in the air. That's pretty rough, though. I'm not vegetarian. I just eat very little meat. Um, I basically, like chicken and turkey are like the only meats I eat. For various like reasons. I'm a pescatarian without the fish. I'm a, I'm a poyotarian. As, the as... chickenterian. <laughs> sure. Do we bounce or do we amass here? I think we amass because we want to hit land. It's going to hurt. Oh, for crying out loud, dude. Now it's going to hurt more. I would say the enlarge, but last time we did that, yeah, we I think it's it. I think it's a gin. Wow, that was so bad, dude. Get wrecked. Man, this is just bad news, bears. Oh, yeah, I'm on the land. I'm gonna show up fast and be like the yeah. <clears throat> Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Blah. 
If we play Star Compass, we can potentially Rampaging Bailoff, but that doesn't do much for us because... Because that's all we can do, and they still have two flyers. I think we actually just have to repeal here. We could Genesis Hydra for three. I don't like that, Man. though. God, if we had one more land, we can Star Compass and repeal. If this came into play untapped, we can Star Compass and repeal. If only... All the ingredients for the veggie sandwich aren't together. You have to grab them from the dressing bar. Also, you cook them on... Oh, you can't cook them on the main grill. Interesting. Well, I have to assume you get them considerably less than regular sandwiches, though, right? Like, that has to be... That has to make it a little better, right? God, I don't even want to block. Look how far behind we are. It's real bad. It's not great. Like, if we drew a, cal a Carving Carry out of this game, or, like, a Search for Mara, this another Search for Mara, this game, like, I think we'd be in much better shape. Claustrophobia would be great here. What? Oh, God, what are you doing? Yep. Drew an island, that's pretty good. I was thinking fireball too, because four, five, six, seven, they fireball us for six, and they would have dealt three more, so we would have went to two. Five cards in hand, huh? I cannot imagine why you did not attack with this, but... We're definitely playing this, because we have no reason not to. This might be a Genesis Hider for four turn. Because I don't think we have anything else to do. And this could hit anything good. Oh. Oh, I like that. Cast a non-land permanent. Okay, I'm going to hit okay. Oh, that's the only one we can cast anyway. Choose a non-land permanent. I chose it. Yeah, that's pretty good. Because if you did have, like, a fireball, this is much better. Oh, I like that. And we have two Hunt the Weeks for their flyers. Don't come down. Don't come down. Oh, wow. This guy's on four. Oh, that's great. <laughs> that's... Fatal Roundhouse. This is round two. We are up a match. So, good. I actually don't eat fish and seafood. I did when I was a kid. And then somehow, like, at some point, the idea of, like, fish and, like... It just weirded me out to eat. I think meat in general just weirds me out to eat. And the reason I eat chicken and turkey is because they look cleaner. They just don't look... They don't look like typical meats. Does that make sense? I don't know if they're any cleaner. They're not cleaner. Sure. They're not like a cleaner meat. But it looks like... Like if you look at ground beef or you look at steak, like that looks like meat. Whereas chicken doesn't really. So mentally it's like a different thing to me. Oh, really? Brutal. Then we just we can just hunt that we can kill it now, because <laughs> they can't play their dragon this turn. Actually, that's gonna be pretty. Oh, it's pro. Yeah, it's pro blue. We can just hunt that we can kill it. That's actually hilarious. Yeah, because we're at nine. Look at four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. They'll literally fireball us to death if they have fireball. And then we can play Star Compass. Wow. Aggressive. I don't think there's a way we win here, actually. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Like, we definitely want to just kill this guy, but 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... Like, if they have Fireball and we kill this guy, they just attack and shoot us with the Fireball. I mean, we have If we kill this guy. Yet. Right, but they're probably waiting. Is this game one or game two? It was game two, crushing game one, right? I don't know. I don't remember. I think we did. you think there'd be a way to display that. <laughs> you 
there isn't like it's so funny because i'm like let's go back to the thing uh no it doesn't say anywhere all right good times one day one two three four we have seven actual we have access to seven man oh game gang one uh was the bail off yeah cool It's game two and you win? What? What am I missing? <laughs> do I win? How do I win here? Don't think we can win. I here. think that's just crazy. Yeah, I think we just kill this guy. Oh, no, we kill the bird. And then we get to block here, I guess. Seven, eight, nine. So ten, ten. Five, five, and seven is only 17. We'll put them to three. If we had one more land, we can kill both his guys, which would be absolutely insane. I think we're just going to land Star Compass. I hate to play a land we have Bailoff in hand, but whatever. I mean, if you have Fireball, you have Fireball, and we're just dead, so. Let's see how fast they tap Roshin Meander. If they tap Roshin Meander, I'm just going to be like, well, done. This does not look like Fireball Mana. This looks like Furnace Wall Mana. Now it doesn't. I own his judgment. All right. Do we just go to two here? Rough. No. It's also pretty clear they don't have Fireball or else they would have just killed us. So that's good. Land. Yeah, that's where we want to be. <laughs> Alright, perfect. Seems good. Next turn we can enlarge if they don't attack. Which is actually pretty insane. Oh, but they can just tap their guy at four mana so they don't have to block it. I guess we just I guess we just hunt the weak then. Another judgment. Oh <sighs> well, we're definitely blocking you if you attack. If you don't, we're gonna hunt the weak. I will block. If we draw another green, we can Heroes Bane and activate. That's perfect. Actually, we didn't need another green. We needed any land. So now we get 88 against the white red deck, which is pretty good. Unless they have swords here. Another judgment. No, they're just going to draw a card. Yeah, th judgment number three. Sure. If this guy comes down and doesn't attack, we get to give this guy plus seven, plus seven. And force them to block. Can we do even more? We can also pump it. Oh, God. Just don't have another... Don't have judgment number three, and I think we're good to go. Draconic Roar. Okay. Okay. <laughs> sure. Oh, boy. Otherwise, I think we just win that game if they don't have double, because we just go... Pump, enlarge, and then it's like a million, a million. So they literally have to have two three mana burn spells and a dragon in hand. Whatever. I like Aerial Predation here, actually, because they have a bunch of floating bros. Fog Bank doesn't even seem that good here. Really? Blocks everything. It does, but they have Draconic Roar. They have Double Jet. Eh, I guess it's fine. They have Roar and Helix, but which both kill it. Yeah. I want to take our repeal. It seems really slow against their four and five drops. Enlarge art is so weird to me. Well, it, what what problem is? It's a big cat. It's just like a Photoshop of a cat into some water. It's weird.
Yes. Ugh. Sure. This is actually pretty good against them, I think. Um, Yeah, that's actually fine. Yeah, we want a creature for hunt. And it's turn three, so that's cool. What up, Roshin? It's like Pusheen. Oh, man. I want to get a Roshin Meander altered to be Pusheen. <laughs> and then you can call it Pusheen Meander. That's funny. Play something bad so we can kill it. Wild size, I don't think wild size is better. I think uh Forcing them block is relevant. Yeah, forcing the block is board. very relevant. Dude, can we get a Genesis Harder? We can Genesis Harder for six here, that would be absolutely insane. Plus seven plus seven is also a, such a huge amount. Like even on a two two, it's nine. It's, it becomes a nine nine. Drew for you eighty nine. Thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. You are great. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. Because those people would be monsters. I guess we can attack. You're probably gonna take it because you wouldn't block with a four. You wouldn't just throw your four four away here. So. Our hand's actually great right now if we draw one more land. Although it would also take a, uh, you know, Genesis Hydra. Because then it'd be Genesis Hydra for seven. And we can hit anything in our deck. Which is... Actually, we took out both of our seven drops. We took out Day and we took out the Worm, so... Yeah. I will take four. I imagine you're going to block here. Alright, so now you have Iona's Judgment Mana, which is real scary. Well, let's see the block. Maybe we'll get another land, then we can just play a five, six drop. Then just play Growth Tramor, then play another six drop. Sure. Yay! Here comes Helix, ready? This guy's getting Helix to 100%. Yeah, he just got five life. <laughs> Should we click that thing? <laughs> Helix. Draconic Roar also works, sure. So we lost a Meander, you lost these two. That seems fine. Still two for one. And you're in Judgment, this guy. Yep. Can we get Bayloth right here? That would be just insane. Be pretty good. One, two, three, four, five, six. No. No, we cannot. And Judgment again. We go to six. Okay, that's fine. Hey, we that's did it. One. That's actually great. This is why we kept Simic Growth Chamber in our hand, actually. In case the off chance we draw Bailoff. But we're not attacking here because that would be silly. And if I think if you had if you had Judgment, you probably would have gotten rid of our 4-5 and Judgmented it and then attacked for 4 because that just puts you in a better position. And we would have had nothing else. So I, I think this guy is safe for at least a turn. Plus, you, have, you seem to have a lot of lands. It's turn 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So you've played a land every turn, which means you could still have lands in hand. I always want to play this first just because if uh, they do some shenanigans, we might not get it. So there's no harm in like just getting a dude out. Calculated uh, coordinated strike here is just insane. Just go shoot both of our guys down for a one, one mana red instant. Hopefully not. 
But it is uncommon. Yeah, hopefully not. It is uncommon, so. If you block here, then you're probably going to do it, which is super disheartening. <laughs> I'd rather you have, like, a burn spell to trade, but... Oh, that's good. Are we just trading Roshi Mandra for Beast? Wow, that's great. Netcaster Spider blocks this guy in trades, which is awesome. I think we're... I think we just... As Marshall Sutcliffe would say, I think we just turned the corner here. They're at six. They have to block a lot of things. Like, if we attack, they block here. And they deal with this guy, they still take eight. That guy's not going to do it. Look how tiny this is. <laughs> Sweet trigger. Oh. Do they know about Netcaster Spire? What? Good that, deal. That did not seem like they thought... They I, they might not have known that guy had reach. That seemed awkward. Look at this Simic Growth Chamber, dude. <laughs> doing do, doing all work. All the work. It's literally just make a 4-4 four, four every turn. Yeah, this is the time where, like, if you're going to spend a spell to kill this guy, and you're going to block here just so you can go to 2, deal. Good games. I'm not going to be able to say it. Oh, sweet. Cool. All right. Did it. Well, this deck has been going well. Indeed. Might be the Rampaging Baylos. That card's good. I think we're 100% in matches that we played Rampaging Baylos. Who knew that Broodmate Dragon with continuous upside is good? Mm -hmm. Oh, this hand's great. Turn 2 wall, turn 3 mander, turn 4 mander. Sure. I mean, we don't have a blue source, but we can. We got. We got a draw. Yeah, Simic Growth Chamber OP. What up, Kermit the Frog? I actually like this chat on the screen a lot. It seems real elegant. It looks good. I think it looks good. Let me know what you guys think. I mentioned this the other day, but I'm still curious. And also, if you guys are watching on YouTube, let me know what you think too, because I know there was a lot of times where I, we would be chatting. And responding to people in the chat. And you guys wouldn't be like, I don't know what, what was there a funny joke? I don't know what's going on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See you later, bye. Is that a known one or something? Uh, no, if they if it's just a random person with like Turbo or like Twitch Prime, I think. Um, and they're like, oh my god, WTF is that? And then they show a random, like it says screenshot underscore VEA7. Then like... Mm -hmm probably not going to be a good one no they're just they're just bots it sends you to like a stupid page it sends you to like a scam page oh they are legendary thank you oh they're legendary that, what i didn't know that either actually i had no idea is roshin meander its name yeah apparently night after night roshin babbled about a bygone sunlit world her every word dismissed as a mad woman's ravings I mean, she looks pretty mad. Why you have to be mad? It's only game. It's only game. Why you have to be mad? It's an old meme, but it checks out. It does check out. Are they not going? What's going on here? Why is it taking so long? What's the problem? See. All right, they did it. We did it. Ooh, the old mill deck, eh? Or they're just playing the old Phantasmal, Jace's Phantasm deck. Do I have any commander decks in real life or online? The answer to both is no. <laughs> so there oh, you, you go. You that one apart? Which one in real life? I have one in real life, but it was never... I'm missing cards for it. Like, I wasn't super thrilled with it. It was just a deck I put together. Like. 
It wasn't like, this is a commander deck I've been working on a bunch. It's weird to see legendary creatures, not rares. I said that. That's exactly, yeah, I agree. That's exactly what I said. Because I feel like by nature, if you're legendary, you should be rare, right? Like, you're a legend. What kind of, sh think. What kind of shitty legend is, is uncommon? Checking if you should bring one where? Are we hanging out? What's going on? When are we hanging out? Why is my wall of roots taking so long to resolve? I don't understand. You'll never understand. Are there any common legendaries? Do you guys know? Back down. Is it down? Oh, was it? It was nine seven, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. That's still insane. Last night it wasn't even nine. That's unbelievable. <laughs> this is how much I. This is how much I'm at less than a month. Like, what? Is How's that real? It's good games. Oh my god, I just want my wall of roots to resolve. Hey, we did it. Oh, the next time we hang out. You can bring it. I'll definitely, like... I can put something together if, if you want me to. Also, let me know the next time we're hanging out, just so, uh... Just so I know. <laughs> Uncommon legends are just like, I'm a big deal, but only to a small number of people. Like my mom. I guess we'll take one. Ah, oh, the old blue-white Jace's Phantasm deck. That's interesting. Curiouser and curiouser. Let's see if you counter this. If you do, it's okay, because I have another Roshin Meander. You didn't. All right, I'm intrigued. Let's see if you sword supply share this. I don't know what's going on. All right, well. A whole lot of nothing. Literally a whole lot of nothing. Hey, man, how do you, like, how do you feel about these windows open? It's all right. It's nice and crisp in here. I've been crisper. <laughs> you live in the crisper. Every day. You live in the crisper every day? Every day, bro. But I'm talking about the scientific one. It's every day, bro. DNA all day, every day. What if we play Carbon Carry at it and we hit hey, Simic Growth Chamber? That'd be pretty sweet, right? Yeah, it would be. Although I do sweet. hate playing Simic Growth, Simic Growth Chamber before we play Rampaging Bailoth. It's okay. We'll just hit a regular line. They still don't count. What are they doing? We did. How did you know, Michael? They didn't counter this. They didn't remove this. They didn't counter this. They didn't counter anything. What's going on? What is this double blue? What's going on right now? Am I being punked? I'm the week on Wall of Roots for unseen value. <laughs> I don't know if that works the way you think it works. I mean, we are dead in nine turns so i guess that's a thing oh no right it's very scary oh man oh man i got a lot of burps coming yeah there's no way i would have noticed the legendary thing i would have totally lost a creature yeah same thing i i it's not that i i think i've i've known roshin meander was legendary i just it's not on my radar right now. No, that's a good draw. Look at all our defenders. We're like the... Yeah, they can't even block. Look, we got Luke Cage. We got Iron Fist here, because it's not great. Uh, we got... Actually, this would probably be Jessica Jones, I guess. Why? And then we got... I don't know, because it's a, it's a female tree. How do you know it's female? Actually, Roshin Meander is female, too. Well, because look, it's got boot. It's literally got... Look at this figure. I don't know. It just Look looks like a face. bunch of weird wood, man. You know what? That's real treeist, bro. That's real arborist.
Oh, you blurb. I get it. Because you mean you thought they were negative one, negative one counter. So this would have canceled out. I get it. So we could have got, uh, uh, we could have removed a plus one, plus one counter. I get you. Do we just play Netcaster Spider so that they never attack again? It's an option. I feel like this is just better, right? 100%. Thank you for confirming. Now it's Mana Leak. you got to have Mana Leak now. There you go. You did it. Condescent for one. Okay, that's also fine. I guess we should have played the Spider. Well, I'm waiting for them to pay costs. There you go. You did it. Sad. Sad. If I have Roshin Meander up and they play Condescend, can I use that to pay the Condescend? Is this a cost that includes X? That's interesting. Hmm. I don't know. Hmm. Hmm. Uh -uh. Huh. I mean, that's one less counterspell they have for our Rampaging Bay loss, I guess. I don't understand how you have these guys in your deck when you're not black. Or milling in general. Right, but they gotta have, you gotta be black to be the mill deck, so that's what I mean. Now we're just gonna hunt the weak that phantom monster and call it a day. Oof. I think we are going to play that because next turn we can play Bailoth and, and Simic Growth Chamber. And your water system's weird. It is. It's not great. They go to seven here? That's pretty good. If they can get eight cards in our graveyard, we're taking ten. That's pretty scary. I don't think they're going to do that. Okay, they're going to play something. Wow, this is real fast. Sarah Angel? Oh, just an Iona's Judgment? Sure. You're going to regret that one, buddy. I got, sp I got beasts for days. For 22 days. Why 22 days? That's the amount of days you have them. There are exactly two common legendaries, Joven and Chandler. Yeah, I know, I know Chandler. It's Matthew Perry from Friends, yeah. Austere Command, here we go. Ready? Okay, I don't care about that. Oh, they're one because they want to be able to double block here. I got you. Just give me a Hunt the Week so I can just murder that Mahamodi Dijin. It's actually just fine. I'll amass some components. Oh, why don't we have another blue? Because you're bad at tapping mana. Well, if I tap two and two. I think that's still fine. Netcaster keeps these guys at bay. Actually, if we just alpha here. No, we only have two guys to alpha with. They just go block. Yeah, that'd be terrible. It wouldn't be terrible. This guy would die. They would mm -hmm. trade with this because they'd probably double block. And then they go to three. And then we still have two of these and a netcaster spider. I actually don't think that's terrible at all. Then do it. And we get to trade with this guy. The alternative is they just chump block here and block here. And that's not great. Yeah, then they take five. Oh, because it has trample. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Never mind. I forgot the trample. Yeah, if you want to trade with this guy, that's... Go to one? Sure. None of those guys were blocking anyway, so we just got a free six damage in there. That's great. Why did you keep this one back if you weren't going to double block here? I thought that was your whole plan. You Five, six, wrong. seven. I mean, if they have a way to get seven more cards in our graveyard right now, then we're done. Then we're done for. That is not it. Okay, good. Actually, no, we have a chump blocker here. Yeah, this is pretty good. And we can still play old Roshi. Master Roshi. Take a seat. Oh, all right. Got him. Look at all these flyers. They played four flyers that game. 
Not yeah. including Phantom Monster. How many how many aerial predations do we bring in? Probably two, right? I think so. This guy is amazing because it blocks all their flyers. Uh, the walls are not great. Is he taking out Caravan? Me too. Enlarge seems reasonable. It gets rid of a flyer. Let's take out Day of the Dragons. Why, man? Not repeal. Sure. Well, because we have to take out something. That's why. That's literally my only reason. No, nah, man. 41 it. And two go Shaman, maybe? Yeah, it's not great. Or we can take out one Roshin Meander. They are legendary. Yeah, that seems good. I'd rather have one of these on four because we just draw a card. Fog Bank doesn't have fling. This guy's got fling. <laughs> it's like flying. Oh, this hand is fantastic. If you meant to put flying there, it actually does have flying. It definitely has flying. It's a bank of fog, man. Fog just floats. I didn't draft the second Rasheen because I didn't know it was legendary. I drafted it because even if you draw two, like, it's still fine. It's fog. It's literally in the air. Quite true. It literally is the air. <laughs> so, you know, you got that going for you. I can feel it coming in the air tonight. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. And I remember, I remember, don't worry, worry. You know that song? That's a good jam. How could I ever forget? It's the first time. <laughs> it's the last yeah. time. That was perfect that I asked you at that moment. And we ever met, 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 met. But I know the reason why. Um, I'm just going to discard Forrest because we have Growth Chamber here. One, two, three, four, five. We'll have six mana on turn four. That's pretty good. I can't. I just can't win you anymore. But I know the reason why. It's the second word of text. There it is. Look. Flying right there. Second word. Literal second word. Four, five. How could I ever forget it's the first spider? Are you sure all those fog bank light -like cards have flying? Just like the jellyfish one. I'm finally not on a train or any other. Are you in a house right now? Are you, are you actually in a house just not... Not moving? Are you in a stationary position? Because that's amazing. I think I can enrage. I can enlarge a fog bank, but I can't attack with it. So if that means anything to you, I will block because it has flying. Despite the fact that J Turp did not believe us. I'm going to keep this arrow predation because I think it's better against bigger creatures like Mahamoti Dijin. Can we just draw a Bailoth here? I guess not. I guess I was asking too much. Clearly. Fog bank flying confirmed. I'm in a house and it doesn't appear to be moving. Well, you better... You better check again. Is your fridge running? You better check. We're constantly moving to the vacuum of space. <laughs> That's true. You're not wrong. Even tapping one of these guys down is not ideal. I hope you tapped on this guy because you don't know this has reach. Because no one ever does. The spider, man. All spiders have reach. All right. That's just their thing. Uh, they knew. Figured it out. God, they're so good. How can the earth be moving if it's flat? Oh. Wait, flat, that doesn't make any sense. Flat things can move. Wrong. <laughs> Fake news. Sad. You shill. <laughs> we 
What are you, a show for fucking for, for Big Sphere? Big Earth? Big Sphere Earth? Big Pop Earth. Oh, that's a good card. Tempted to just bring to just bounce this guy, because otherwise they go tap three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, let's do that. Actually, claustrophobia is probably better there, right? Yeah. This is a dude I just never want to be alive. <laughs> I don't want you to ever be alive, good sir. Bad man. Mm, yes, bad man. I'm also going to repeal here because I can, and I want to be able to... Okay, well. One, two, three, four. I'm going to play a land here, even though I don't like it. Because if we draw Genesis Hydra, I want to make the biggest Genesis Hydra ever. And I like keeping one land for Rampaging Bale Loss, but I also like having less land in hand because of Rampaging Bale Loss. What are you doing? <laughs> you're a real weirdo, my man. <laughs> what gave it away? You're... you're oh, man, I always had that. I feel like every time you play Claustrophobia... God, it's basically like Claustrophobia Counterspell. Yeah, you are a globe shill. Wait, that's me. Why not both? Well, because you're the you're the flat earther and I'm the globe earther. How can how can flat earthers really be a thing in 2017? It just blows my mind. One, two, three, four, five, six. If we play a land, we can keep aerial predation up. Yeah, I don't hate that. Right? No. Oh, got two in the queue. There we go. We did it. We figured it out. Life's hard, and then you, and then you die. This guy's got pro blue. What up, Polar HS? Is that HS for Hearthstone? Is that a Hearthstone? Ref oh, that's so sad. What did that guy ever do to you, man? Nothing. Well, Iona clearly was offended by him. You own what? Ha ha ha. Look at this alpha strike. All right, now we're at a point where I'm probably just going to get rid of Angel of Mercy because... Because for real, we need, we, need, we need a plan. Man, if only they had... Actually, whatever creature they play next turn, we can enlarge and eat it. That's pretty good. The Earth can't possibly be flat. Cats would have pushed everything off of it by now if that was true. Yeah, I guess that's fair. Truth. Look at all these creatures. Almost all of them fly. You fly. Yeah, daily. Daily? Yeah, I fly high, if you know what I mean. Are you talking about your marijuana cigarettes? <laughs> <laughs> oh, crying out loud. Trying to make some dragons? Three dragons, they tap one, then they tap another. Is that good? It makes their attacks pretty bad. It does make their attacks pretty bad. Yeah, sure. I'm pretty sure you're just going to take four here. This is free damage. You're right. Three five fives is probably better than a, an O two, a two three, and a four three. You tap one. If you tap one and then tap another, we still get a block, and then we take what three damage from you. And you have one card in hand, which is great because that's not a lot. Enlarge is pretty bad when they have blinding mage on board, though. Yeah, it's pretty awkward. Yeah, if it was an instant, woo. All right. Well, I get it with the lands. Can we just attack for 10 here? They're probably going to chump block one, take five, and then we take three, four, five, six, seven. That seems fine. Yeah. I wish we were, I was just checking to see if we were in the beginning of combat. If we were in the main phase still, that would be disgusting. Yeah, I'm just going to attack with both. Are you Aether Eyes? Oh, lame. Well, I'm glad they didn't have a second spell. That would have been significantly worse. Oh, they just took five. 
That's pretty rough, though, because now they can just go tap during our turn, tap during their turn again. Wow. Yep. Man, that one dragon made all the difference. Hmm. Well, that is a thing. <laughs> it's not a great thing. Basically does nothing. I feel like I missed a lot of the chat. <laughs> I, I love Hearthstone. I'm a big Hearthstone fan. I can't wait for Kobolds and Catacombs. I also stream Hearthstone occasionally, so... Oh my god. Wow. We're seven... We can deal 12 here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then they tap this guy, and they... Three, four, five, six, and then we die. No. Good. Yeah. Well, we, we actually can't attack here, unfortunately. Yep. Oh, my God. So close. All right. You tap that guy. Three, four, five. And you get rid of this guy, and then we're dead. Nope. That's not a thing. All right. Hmm. This is actually pretty greedy. Oh, they keep the frost links. Do we win here? Oh my god! If they don't have anything, I think we win, because they have they can't block with frost links. Yeah. Get enlarged on. Wow. Oh, got him. Nice. Woo. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you next time.